welcome to another video from iGadgets Techie and today I'm going to show you a tweak called Vertex. Now this tweak merges the multitasking and the control center together and it is based on a iOS 8 concept. Now let me just give you a quick glance and show you how this tweak works. So there you go, all you do is you just swipe upwards and there we have the multitasking cards and you can just swipe across and there you can go back to your home screen. Now to install this tweak because it's not available in the default repos I'm just going to quickly show you which repo you need to add so you can install this tweak. So first of all if we go into our sources and uh, we need to edit and add the actual repo I'm going to give you. The repo is called buyyourapple.net so once you've added the repo, all you need to do is just need to search for Vertex Beta. This is a beta application for now. It hasn't been fully released, which is why it's not available on the default repos. So go ahead and install this and we'll come back once it's installed. So once we've got this installed, we need to make sure this is enabled in the settings. So let's just find Vertex here. So we've got Vertex, make sure it's enabled. We've got quite a few other options available. So we've got swipe up, we've got switch icons. We can also choose to have the gray background. I've left that off for now. And obviously we've got the option to have the round card corners. Now, in terms of the slider, it does say it is just there for testing. So it doesn't make any difference if you obviously um, change the settings there. And um, we've also got the toggles where we can choose the relevant toggles for our, our control center. And in terms of paging, we've got horizontal and vertical. So in order for this to work, all we need to do is just swipe up and there we get the multitasking application cards where we can just swipe across. Now, bear in mind, this is in beta, so it doesn't run as smooth, but it's still not bad um, with it being a, a beta application. So thank you very much for watching this video. I do hope to see you in the next one. If you did enjoy the video, please do give me a thumbs up. And please subscribe if you've got any questions, leave a comment and I'll see you in the next one.